Picture this, a diet where you can lose weight by consuming fats. Sounds like a fantasy, right? Well, it's not. Welcome to the keto diet. Now, hold on to your bacon strips, folks. The keto diet is not your typical weight loss plan. It's a unique beast in the diet jungle, roaring with a high-fat, low-carb motto. That's right, while most diets are screaming cut the fat, keto is sitting in the corner buttering its steak. It's a world where avocados are your best friend, and bread is the unruly neighbor you avoid. It's about turning your body into a fat-burning machine by drastically reducing your carb intake and replacing it with fats. Sounds counterintuitive, doesn't it? But that's the beauty of it. The keto diet isn't just about losing weight, it's about reshaping how your body fuels itself. Who would have thought, losing weight while munching on fats? The keto diet? You're a paradox wrapped in a mystery, deep fried in an enigma. So, you're ready to dive into the world of keto? Excellent, but remember, it's not a deep fried cakewalk. Now, let's break down the basics of the ketogenic diet, or as I like to call it, the goodbye carbs, hello fats diet. Keto, in a nutshell, is a low-carb, high-fat diet. It's like the opposite day of diets where you're eating more fats than carbs. Sounds a bit counterintuitive, right? But here's the catch. Your body learns to burn fat for fuel. Pretty neat, huh? But hold up. Before you start bathing in avocado oil and butter, remember this important rule. Not all fats are created equal. Trans fats? Not your friends. Unsaturated fats from foods like avocados, nuts, and fish. Now those are your new best buddies. And as for carbs, well they're not completely off the table. You'll just be swapping out those simple, processed carbs for complex ones like leafy greens and other veggies. Trust me, your body will thank you. Now you might be wondering, where does protein fit in all this? Well the keto diet is moderate in protein, so you won't be chowing down on steak at every meal, but you'll have enough to keep your muscles happy. Here's a pro tip. Hydration is key. With the decrease in carbs, your body will flush out water more quickly. So keep that water bottle close by. And no, unfortunately, diet soda doesn't count as water. And last but not least, remember that the keto diet is not just about losing weight, it's about health and well-being. So while you might be saying goodbye to carbs, you'll also be saying hello to potentially lower blood sugar levels, improved mental focus, and more energy, among other benefits. So keto beginners, are you ready to say goodbye to carbs and hello to fats? Don't worry, you won't have to bid farewell to flavor. In fact, you might be surprised at just how delicious healthy can be. Now, let's get this keto journey started, and hey, if you're enjoying this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more keto tips and tricks. Now, let's talk about the elephant in the room, or rather the elephant that left the room thanks to keto. So, you've heard about the keto diet, right? It's this super trendy diet where you eat lots of fat, moderate protein, and very few carbs. Sounds counterintuitive? Well, that's where the magic happens. Your body, being the adaptable machine it is, switches from burning carbs to burning fat for fuel. This state is called ketosis. But let's not get too technical. You're here to know if it can help you lose weight. Well, the short answer is yes. The keto diet can be an effective tool for weight loss, but remember it's not just about the weight loss. It's about adopting a healthier lifestyle. Imagine your body as a car. Now you've been fueling it with regular gasoline all this while. But one day, you decide to switch to premium. You might not notice the difference immediately, but over time, your engine runs smoother and your car performs better. That's what keto does to your body. But let's not forget, the keto diet isn't a magic wand. You can't just eat bacon and cheese all day, sit on the couch, and expect to lose weight. It requires discipline and a commitment to making healthier choices. And here's a little secret. The keto diet can also help curb your cravings. When you're eating fewer carbs, you'll notice you're not as hungry as often. So you're not just losing weight, you're also gaining control over your appetite. Is it easy? Not always. Is it worth it? Absolutely. But don't just take my word for it. There are countless success stories out there of people who have transformed their lives with the help of the keto diet. People who have not only lost weight but also gained a new perspective on health and wellness. Remember with keto it's not just about shedding pounds, it's about gaining health. So are you ready to embark on your keto weight loss journey? All right, now that we know what keto is and how it helps weight loss, let's get down to some keto do's and don'ts. First up, the do's. On the keto menu, we've got a whole host of delicious options. Think meat and poultry, your best friends on this journey. And let's not forget fish, especially the fatty ones like salmon and mackerel. They're like the superheroes of the keto world, packed with those all-important omega-3 fatty acids. And then there's eggs, cheese, avocados, and low-carb veggies. Yes, you heard right, veggies are still in the game. 
And the cherry on top, butter and cream, sounds too good to be true, right? But hold your horses because here come the don'ts. And I'm sorry to break it to you but it's a pretty extensive list. The major culprits here are carbs, so that means waving goodbye to pasta, rice and bread. I know it's like breaking up with your favorite band, but don't worry you'll find new favorites on the keto playlist. Also off the table are sugary foods, so candies, sodas and desserts are out, and unfortunately that includes most fruits too. I know it's tough but remember, it's for a greater cause. Now let's talk about a few sneaky ones, beans and legumes, root vegetables and some oils are also on the no-go list. And while we're at it let's not forget alcohol. That's right, most alcoholic drinks are high in carbs so they're a no-no. So, in a nutshell, keto is all about high-fat, moderate protein and low to no carbs. It might seem challenging at first, but once you get the hang of it, it's a breeze. And remember, every journey starts with a single step. So, take that step and who knows where the keto path might lead you. So remember folks, on keto, you can kiss your carbs goodbye but hey, you'll get to cuddle with cream. Well, we've journeyed through the land of keto from its high-fat hills to its low-carb valleys. We've explored the ins and outs of this intriguing diet. And let's be honest, it's been quite the culinary adventure. We kicked things off with a beginner's guide to keto, diving into the basics of what it entails. Remember it's all about high fats, moderate proteins, and low carbs. We also discovered that the keto diet isn't just about weight loss, but also about enhancing overall health and well-being. Then we embarked on the keto weight loss journey, navigating the highs and lows of initial weight loss, the dreaded keto flu. But hey, nothing worth having comes easy, right? We also emphasized the need to consult with a healthcare professional before starting this or any other diet. After all, we're all unique, and what works for one might not work for another. We also delved into the keto diet do's and don'ts, laying down the law of the keto land. From embracing healthy fats to avoiding hidden carbs, we've got you covered. And let's not forget the importance of hydration folks, it's not all about the food. Now as we wrap up our keto adventure, it's time for a call to action. If you enjoyed this video, and let's face it, who wouldn't enjoy a diet where bacon is a superfood, then hit that subscribe button. Share this video with your friends and help spread the keto love. After all, sharing is caring. And remember, whether you're considering the keto diet or any other lifestyle change, it's always about what's best for you. Your health and well-being should always be your number one priority. So, keep exploring, keep learning, and most importantly, keep laughing. Because at the end of day, a good belly laugh burns more calories than any diet. And that's a wrap on our keto adventure. If you liked this video, subscribe to our channel and share it with your friends because who wouldn't want to spread the word about a diet where bacon is a superfood? And now, we would love it if you could take a moment to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Your support makes all the difference and allows us to continue creating content like this. Remember, your likes and subscriptions fuel our journey and keep us exploring further. So, make sure to hit that like button and stay connected by subscribing. Thank you and see you on the next keto adventure.